Hi ladies, I'm back today with a box opening of a tray that I did with my good dolly friend. And she knows who she is and she packed a wonderful um, box of babies and clothes. So I'm going to get started. I'm going to try to be quick because I try not to go over 15 minutes. But if I don't um, get something in, then I will make another video showing everything. But the box is over here to the side, so I'm going to, um, I'm not going to show the box, but I am pulling stuff out of the box, just so you know. Look at, she made these little nice bags, and in it, I already know what's in it. It's, um, matching piggy onesies for my little silicone twin girls. And she got these for me. For Battleful Baby. There's one of them. So I'm going to have lots of clothes. Like I said, I probably won't be able to go through all the clothes. Um, look, she sent the cutest passy. It's like a butterfly. And that can probably go with my silicone girls too. I'm sure she was thinking of them when she made this. And she also makes bracelets to sell. And she sent me a bunch of them. And I am going to... Um, Get her link i'm gonna come back on and make a video just with her bracelets so you can contact her and i will give you her contact information this one says baby and she can make them with designs that she's come up with or she can design them to how you want them this one says rocco for my rocco baby and her bracelets are very affordable and really cute bracelets this one says kitty for my glam kitty and this one says princess. This is for one of my um my little silicones, I think. Princess. Well, actually, that's not for my silicones. This the other one is in here for my silicones. So I'm just gonna go through this quick with you. Oh, I will come back later and maybe show. You, I will come back later and do a separate video for her bracelets. Here's the matching onesie that's going to be for the twin girls. And she has a special um, bracelet in here. And it says Journey. That's for little Miss Journey. You know, Emmy and Journey, the, the silicone baby twins. That's, she has made a bracelet made special for her. Hope everyone is well today. I am not sure, like I said, I'm going to get through all of this, but I will try to get through most of it. Here's some stuffies she sent me. Two stuffies, a bunny and a bear, and these are great for when I do my customs. I like to give away stuffies. And what I'm going to do, you know what, I'm going to show you the babies first, and then if we have time, we can get to the clothes. She sent me lots of clothes for my, um, so I do the sale, baby clothes sale videos, the live sale videos so she sent me lots of clothes for those so i will be i think i'm going to do there's so many clothes like i said i'm definitely gonna have to do these last because i won't be able to um do that so now the first baby i'm going to show you is i believe it's an ashen drake it is not a reborn baby yet but she's adorable and i plan to reborn her with um air dry paints I can't tell which way her face is, so we're just going to find out. I think she might be backwards. Let's see. I think she's like that. So we're going to see her. She comes in a really pretty pink blanket. I've had these blankets before. I love them. They're so soft and pink. I love this paint. I've been seeing this. People use this tape, and I've just noticed it. It's really cute. I might get some for wrapping my babies up. I'm going to send them out. So she's wrapped up nicely. And we're going to see her feet. She's a big girl. I told you, just so you know, you won't be able to recognize her sculpt, I doubt, unless if y'all collect Ashton Drake babies. Or it might be Lee Middleton. She's one of those factory babies, but she's really cute. So I'm going to show you. She's got little hearts. She's got the cutest outfit on. Let's put the sweetest outfit on. So yeah, it's a little foot, and she's going to be so fun to reborn. She's got nice details. So I'm just showing you her feetsies. Let me see her feet. See her feet. She is adorable. She really is. Here's one of her hands. And she, you're going to like her face. She has the cutest expression on her face. There's her other hand. And she can suck her thumb also. 
There's her overhead. So we're going to see her face now. She's really cute. Look at her face. Look at that big open mouth she has. I love it. So she has a wig, which is her wig is pretty good. And I also have another wig I could even put on her if I decided to. But isn't she adorable? I'm going to, um, and actually she's not that light. She's weighted. And I love her little face. She's got the cutest little open mouth. And she can take a, um, what do I do with that passy? Do I have to? Watch, I'm going to shoot, put that passy in because she can take this passy. So I'm going to reborn her to be a human. What do I do with all that stuff I just took out? Yeah, I'm going to reborn her to be a human. And this is, this passy I think will fit her. It's really cute. I'm going to give it to her and try. She can take a full passy, I believe. So we're going to put her in here. Let's see if she'll take it. Oh, look, look how good she takes that passy. She's so cute. She is cute. I'm going to clean her up. She's clean, though. She has nice, big brown eyes and lashes. So I will be reborning her with um, air dry paints. I won't have to put a lot of paint on her because she's really cute. And she's way too nice. Look, she can sit up like a big girl. She says, I sit up like a big girl. If any of y'all are familiar, happen to be familiar with her sculpt, her name, let me know. Because I'd be interested to know if you knew. I'm not sure if her friend knew her name. But look how she takes that passy. I love her eyelashes. Let's see if she could take her, um, thumb. I think she can, if you position her right. I think she can suck her thumb. I think that she told me that. Or maybe not, I'm not sure. But she looks like she can suck it, her thumb. So I'll be reborning her pretty soon and like I said she won't need a whole lot um so it won't take me long to reborn her probably not long at all because I'm not gonna like paint everything I'm just gonna give her um some blushing and creases and stuff like that so there she is there's my, my little girl I'm gonna brush her up clean her up tonight she's clean but I'm just gonna brush her up and I love this outfit Leslie that you gave her or sent her in it's so cute see how cute she is so, and if you're all familiar with her sculpt, happen to be, just let me know. And I love that she takes the full passy in her mouth. So, we're going to set her over to the side and give her a passy so she'll be happy. As she came. My dolly friend that made a tray doesn't live far from me, so. Just like one state over, so. She didn't have to travel too far. She got here on time. And here is... The other baby I traded for. Now this one, I could possibly reborn with him, but I'm not going to because he's really not the kind that I'll consider reborn. And he is a fantasy baby, so y'all can get all excited and wonder what he is. He is a fantasy baby. So let's see what we got here. Now I'm probably gonna about to tell right away what he is. <laughs> Look how cute he is. Can y'all tell? His legs do bend. He's a whoop. The girl fell. She says, you're not me over, mama. Can you tell what he is by his feet? He's gray. He's a gray boy. So let's see. Oh, she has him dressed so cute. He has his little hands. And he's by Ashton Drake. I know that for sure. He has his little arms. Ready? <gasps> Ta-da! Look at his big old head! Oh, I knew he had a big old head, but I didn't know it was... This big, he's got a huge old head. Look at him. He's mostly head. He says, I got a big head, mama. I got a real big head. He's so cute, though. I didn't even realize this was so big. He's got a huge monkey head. But he's adorable. Oh, you think he's cute? He's the alien from Ash and Drake. I love how shiny his eyes are. Look at this fella. He's really heavy. <laughs> when she told me she has to get a big enough box from now, I don't know why. Because in the pictures, I didn't realize his head was quite so big. He has a big head. But he can see everybody real good with his big old head. So there he is. I got him. And I don't think I will be reborn in him because, I mean, he's nicely done. He's uh, he's actually nicely painted. I don't think I'll need any reborning. I could possibly put a little color on his lips and maybe the bottom of his feet. But I don't really plan to reborn him. And as you know, um, look, and he's got little dots on his head. I think that's intentional. I think he's supposed to have dots. But look how cute she has him dressed. He's tiny here. That's definitely a preemie. So look how cute he is. So if you want to go through some of the clothes, I'll set her right here. I 
shows the app. You want to see that, little girl? We'll go through some of the clothes and we'll let the little alien hold the clothes. Or we're going to put them on the alien because he's little. Right, let's see. Let's go through some of the clothes. I don't have a whole lot of time, but I have some. Because there's no way I'll have time to go through the clothes. But maybe later I'll just do the clothes. Show you the clothes. And I am making another trade with her. She's downsized in her collection. So I will... She may have that trade off the date. And it's another two babies. And, um... Some more clothes. And different things surprises. This is really cute. I like this. I'm going to keep this. So, like, a lot of these I'm going to sell in the sale. But some of them I'm going to keep. This one looks really cute. I'm going to keep this one. Just a jumper. Romper. I think them girl call those rompers. I'm sorry I'm having to walk all around the camera. So, it's kind of annoying to y'all and me. This is really cute. A pretty pink onesie with a flower. I'm trying to pull out some unusual pieces. These are brand new, she sent. Oh, that's nice. That's a brand new uh, Wrangler top. That is neat. Somebody's going to like that. She likes the animal themes, like all the different jungle animals and stuff. So here's another one. Here's a onesie. All the animals on it. Like I said, if you're interested in baby clothes, I have try to have a couple sales a month, like every other week or so. And I sell all my baby clothes. Those are really cute, too. I sell all the baby clothes at very reasonable prices, and they have set prices. And then y'all pay shipping, and I ship only ship um, flat rate boxes or a mailer, which you don't get much in the mailer. Only like two small outfits would fit. Everybody likes monkeys. A lot of people are going to want this monkey onesie. And so how much of this for animals? Oh, this is really pretty. I'll have to get the wrinkles out of it, but it's like a vintage out doll outfit. I think that's a vintage doll outfit. I'll be keeping that for the babies. Very cute. Let's see. I'm trying to pull out some of the different looking pieces. There's some cards. There's a lot of, I think it's all mostly boy stuff. Let's see. This one's really cute. I think this one's adorable. Cars. I'm just trying to pull some pieces out here. It's a girl. Oh, I really like this one. It is, like I said, I might keep this myself. That's pretty. It's just white with bunnies. Do you see the bunnies? They're like, have their back to you, the bunnies. And some of them have their head turned to the side. And the alien boys just sitting there. If y'all have any name suggestions for the new babies, let me know. Oh, this is so cute. This is an embroidered train. On there. Really cute clothes. I've oh, got tons of clothes, so I, like I said, I can't go through them all. But if you liked it, purchase some really good, cute clothes at a reasonable price. Please come over to my... Um, Facebook page that's called Nevermore Fantasy and Human Reborn Dolls. And that is the page where I do the sales from. Like I said, I do a couple, two or three a month. This week I've actually done two in a row. So that one is cute. I love that. It says fishing for compliments. It says a tiger. Not a tiger, a lion. Oh no, I'm crazy. So I just want to show you that. And I'm not going to go too much further with the clothes because I don't want you to... Um, I don't want to go over my times because it will take forever to upload. So I just want to show you this stuff today. These cute babies and clothes. I hope y'all like them. And if you can give me some name suggestions, go ahead and, and tell me some name suggestions. This is little Ashton Drake Alien. He's really cute. And he's definitely going to wear a preemie. He has a, his head is heavy. I mean, I can, like when I pick him up, he is all head. But I love those eyes. And he's got like a purple... Sheen to him on his lips and his around his eyes. I don't think he has a name. It doesn't say. He doesn't have a name. Like a sculpt name, I don't believe. Probably just alien. Look at that head. I mean, I could reborn him, but I kind of I like him the way he is. Because, like, as you know, I got a girl, that little tiny, tiny alien sculpt, the girl. I haven't painted her yet. And here is his sissy. We didn't have too far to travel, so just let me know what you think about names for these two. I think they're really cute. I think they're cute, and I love that she takes a full passy. She's so cute. 
So I will talk to you soon and tomorrow I'm excited. I am supposed to be getting a um, mold for a silicone head tomorrow to a newborn size baby. And I will be able to make snuggle babies with silicone heads and cloth bodies. Um, paint them once I start pouring the heads. So tune in tomorrow. If it comes tomorrow, I will be making a video of just the uh, mold. And if it's interesting, if you all like to see what a real mold looks like for silicone babies, then you can come see. I'll be doing a um, video for that. I'm not sure. I may do a live video and then also a video here on YouTube for the silicone mold, for the head mold. And he's a really, he's a really cute baby. He has an open mouth. I can take a bassy. So anyway, I will talk to you soon. Thank you for joining me tonight. And I hope you like the new babies. And like I said, please give me name suggestions if you have any. And if you know the sculpt of this little girl, I think she's Lee Middleton or Asha Drake. If you know her sculpt or anything about her, just let me know. I think she's really cute. And her brother's holding her hand with his big old head. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all soon. Stay safe and stay blessed. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for coming to join me tonight.